Hello everyone, in this video we're going to look at our first list operations that we're going to learn and we're going to look at how Python uses numbers to keep track of where each element is in our lists. I've set up a list here called planets and in there I've put the names of all the planets. So what Python does when you set up a list is basically the first item in the list, it gives an index number two, and that one is index number zero. Venus is index one, Earth is at index two, Mars is at index three, and so on. So what I can do is I can use that number. So if I put um, position equals, equals three, I can save a number of an index position in a variable and then I can output print from the planets list the planet at position like that. Don't forget my brackets. So what that will do You've got three things going on in this line six. This refers to the position variable here, which we'll see has three in it. So this refers to the planets list up here. And this tells the program to output what it finds. So this means go to the planets list, find the planet at position three, because that's what's stored in the position variable, and output it onto the screen. Let's have a little look here. Watch my, I'll run this one line at a time. Watch my variables change as I do it. Okay, there we go, we're on line one. So I'll press F6. You'll see that it's put all the planets into the planets list. I'm now on line four, so this should put the number three into the position variable. And then output planets position. So it will go to the planets list, go zero, one, two, three, and output, should output Mars. So let's have a look down here in our shell and see what happens. There we go, it's found Mars. The trickiest bit is to remember that indexing or counting starts at zero not at one 